Hello, Vichyo. Let's read the question. The question says that a ball is released from rest from point P of a smooth semi-spherical vessel as shown in figure. The ratio of centripetal force and normal reaction on the ball at point Q is A while angular position of point Q is alpha with respect to point P. Which of the following graphs represented the correct relation between A and alpha when the ball goes from Q to R. So, we will solve this question. First of all, we will see what will be the key concept used to solve this question. The key concept that will be used to solve this question is centripetal force Fc is equal to mv square by r. Now, we will see that the ball is at point P. So, initially, it has velocity 0 as it is released from rest and it reaches point Q and at point Q it attains some velocity V so centripetal force at point Q Fc will be equal to mv square by r now we have to find this velocity V so we can see if the radius of the semi-spherical vessel is r so this distance that is the vertical height from P to Q that will be H that will be R sine alpha. So if we conserve energy from point P to Q conserving mechanical energy mechanical energy from point P to Q we have at point P we have the potential energy that is mgh and kinetic energy is 0 at point P at point Q the potential energy becomes 0 as we are taking this line as datum and the kinetic energy is a half mb square so from here we have V is equal to root over 2gh and h is r sin alpha so v is equal to root over 2 gr sin alpha so centripetal force is equal to mv square that is m into 2 gr sin alpha by r this is small r itself so this will cancel so 2 mg sin alpha this will be the centripetal force now we will see at point Q there will be three forces acting first is mg downward and second is n inward and the third is m mv square by r which is centrifugal force radially outward so if this angle is alpha then this angle will also be alpha so this angle will be 90 minus alpha. So, a component of mg towards this normal will be mg sin alpha, mg sin alpha. So, if we balance force at this point q along this normal, so we will have normal is equal to mv square by r plus mg sin alpha and mv square by r is 2 mg sin alpha as we have calculated here plus this is mg sin alpha so normal will be equal to 3 mg sin alpha now we have been given the ratio of centripetal force and normal reaction at point q is a so A is equal to Fc by normal and Fc is 2mg sin alpha and normal is 3mg sin alpha. So A will be equal to 2 by 3. Now as we can see that A is constant and does not vary with alpha. So the graph of A with alpha will be a straight line. And that will be a flat line. So this is 
द ग्राफ ऑफ ए विथ अल्फा सो द करेक्ट ऑप्शन विल बी ऑप्शन डी नन ऑफ दी सो दिस विल बी द एंसर होप यू वॉल अंडर स्टूडी ट्वेल्व बेस्ट ऑफ लॉ